So your insurance company is telling you that you need to file a new claim because the damage that you claimed was caused by something else. Why is that your problem? All right, for the scenario, we're gonna talk about a wind damage claim where the carrier says it's actually vandalism. You file for wind because your contractor gets on your roof and says that you have wind damage. For all you know, you've got wind damage on your roof. You say, all right, we have wind damage and it happened on this date. And then your carrier comes out, possibly meets with your contractor, hopefully with a public adjuster, Either way, they came out and they said it isn't wind. It's actually vandalism. We need you to file a new claim for vandalism because it wasn't wind damage. Why would they have you do that? How does that benefit them? It actually puts you in a precarious position because if you file a new claim, you have another claim on record. The more claims you have on record, the more likely it is that you're going to file claims. You're a higher risk individual. Your rates go up the more claims that you have. This isn't good for you. You don't want to file a new claim. You've already filed a claim for that damage. And the policy says, file to the best of your knowledge and belief the time and cause of loss. You filed for wind because the contractor said it was wind damage. You don't know any better. How often do you get on the roof? This is to the best of your knowledge. It doesn't say that you have to guess what the cause of loss is correctly to get coverage. Some insurance carriers will take it even further and say that you have to file for vandalism and you have to file a police report and accuse someone of that vandalism for them to give you coverage. Most of the time, the policy doesn't require you to file a police report. That's a big problem because if you file a police report on your home, your property values come down. Now the insurance carrier is putting you in a position that's going to reduce your financial standing. They can't do that legally. So they're asking you to do something that makes you a higher risk that can increase your rates. And they're asking you to do something that's going to lower your property values and the property values of the whole neighborhoods. Your neighbors might get mad at you because now there's a higher crime rate in your area. This isn't good. If you file a claim for something that to the best of your knowledge is correct, the carrier has the option to just change the cause of loss. You don't have to file a new claim. They can change it in their system. It's the same damage. There's absolutely no reason for them to force you to file a new claim. You need someone in your court backing you up when things like this happen. You need a good public adjuster. Let us deal with the bull.